Hello guys, here is Yuli and you are welcome to my kitchen. Today I am going to show you how to make desi chicken fry. Desi chicken means Indian local chicken, local hen or cock or rooster. The meat of Indian chicken is generally little hard. So I will show you the way to make it juicy and soft. The flesh is stick to the bones but it's soft and juicy and crispy from the outer side. So guys let's see the recipe. You can see guys that I have taken some pieces of desi chicken and it's red in color as you can notice. And I have put some cuts in it. You also have to do this. And I only have two leg pieces. So I have taken only two leg pieces and some other pieces. Two wings and some other small pieces of chicken. So now we need to marinate the chicken. So I am taking half teaspoon of black pepper powder. Half teaspoon of roasted cumin seeds powder. Half teaspoon of roasted coriander seeds powder, one four teaspoon of turmeric powder, one teaspoon of red chili powder, about one teaspoon of garam masala, half teaspoon of paprika powder for a brighter color, about one teaspoon of regular salts or according to taste, and one teaspoon of dark soy sauce. One teaspoon of crushed ginger garlic. I crush them, but you may take the paste. There is no problem. And now two teaspoons of curd. It's little sour curd. And now we need to mix everything very nicely for marination. And after mixing nicely, we need to marinate the chicken for about one hour in the fridge. The minimum time should be uh, thirty minutes, and the maximum time may be uh, five to six hours. So now we need to make a flour mixture. So I am taking a bowl of maida. Maida means all purpose flour. And 2 tablespoons of corn flour. Half teaspoon of regular salt. 1 4 teaspoon of turmeric powder. 1 teaspoon of red chili powder. Half teaspoon of black pepper powder. Half teaspoon of garam masala. And half teaspoon of roasted cumin seeds powder. So now we need to mix everything very well. And our flour dusting will be ready for frying. So our flour mixer is ready. And after about half an hour, I am taking the chicken out. Now I am going to make the main process of the chicken fry. So I am taking the flour mixture. Here it is. Our marinated chicken. And some chilled water. So now I am taking a piece of chicken. And coating the chicken piece with the flour. We need to coat it very well, very nicely in the curds we made. Like this. We need to fill all the curds we made with the flour dusting. Like this. And after the coating is done nicely, we need to dip the chicken piece in the water. So. It's ready. I'm dipping it in the water for ounce. We need to do this process very quickly. And now we need to add it in the flour again and coat the flour again on the chicken piece. This process will make the coating prominent and it will make it crispy from the outer side. So it's ready. I'm removing the extra flour. And our chicken piece is ready to go to fry. In the same process, I am going to prepare the second piece of chicken. At first, coating with the flour. And after that, dipping it in the water, in the chilled water. And after dipping, Again coating with the flour. It's the main process of the chicken fry. In the same process, I'm going to prepare all the chicken pieces. And all of them are ready. So, let's go for frying process. We need a medium hot oil for this process. And our oil is medium hot. Now, I'm adding the chicken pieces. I'm adding three pieces of chicken now. Because I got a small quantity of oil. So after adding the chicken pieces, my heat is on medium and after about 2 minutes of frying on medium heat, I am going to turn it low and on low heat, I am going to fry it for about 10 to 12 minutes. After about 3 to 4 minutes of frying, I am flipping them 
After frying for 10 minutes on low heat, if the color is not yet golden, you may turn the heat on medium again to bring the color. And after the color is nicely golden red, our chicken fries are ready as you can see. So now it's time to take them out. I'm taking a big strainer and taking the chicken pieces out on the strainer. I'm going to put it like this for some time on another vessel to remove the excess oil. And in the same process, I'm going to fry all the chicken pieces. So guys, after frying all of them, here are they. Our chicken fries are very crispy from the outer side and so soft and juicy from the inner side. For making soft and juicy desi chicken fries, adding curd is compulsory and the marination time should be as long as possible. So guys, try this simple recipe at home and don't forget to share your experience with me. I'm showing you that it's very crispy from the outer side and very soft and very juicy from the inner side. It's sticking to the bones because it's desi chicken, it's Indian chicken, but it's not the fact, it's the juiciness and the softness of the chicken. If you have desi Indian chicken, then don't forget to try this recipe. Hit the like button guys if you really liked the video and please don't forget to subscribe to my channel. Thank you so much for watching. Bye bye.